I was an atheist and a pretty intense atheist. Actually worked with some friends of mine to help found the Atheist Association um, in my college. And I would go around with to different Christian groups and I would argue and debate the pastor and, and speaker. And um, I got into a massive car accident in March of 91 where I was rear-ended by a guy going 110 miles an hour. And I really should have died in that car accident and I spiraled into a very deep depression, actually dropped out of college because of that. One friend, Angie, uh, reached out to me and just regularly would call me and just cared for me as a person. She never tried to share the gospel with me or make me believe, she just loved me as a friend. And I really began to see how God was real in her life. And she was different from a lot of the other Christians that I felt were really fake. And so when I really hit rock bottom, I reached out to Angie and she shared with me about her relationship with Christ. And in all the times that I had had Christians telling me I was gonna burn in hell, no one told me that Jesus loved me and could have a relationship with me. And so God really started an amazing process to prove himself and show that he was real. And so on January 6, 1992, at 10 o'clock at night, I prayed, um, God, I don't know how you can accept someone like me, but if you can, please do. And that's when I came to faith in Christ.